Hey, it's Fanny of Living Richie on a Budget. So I'm at Dollar Tree checking out what they have in January. So let's get started. You guys, check this out. Look at this. Dollar Tree has a fairy garden village. Oh my gosh. There's a boathouse, a sandcastle, a tiki bar, a camper. Look at the details. I think the tiki bar is my favorite. Look at this cute doctor's office and they have different flowers like tulips and mushrooms and this waffle which belongs to the sweet set. Most of these are like little houses with a window and a door. Check out this carrot one and an apple, a windmill, and even a chicken coop. And also a cactus and a sunflower and a tree. And if that wasn't cute enough, they have these little figurines that go with the fairy garden. They have these flower and mushrooms and a windmill with a chicken and... A sand pail with coral and this one goes with the beach collection and this one's for the farm collection with the carrots and this is for the enchanting collection the little fairy what do you think you guys are you gonna go and get this let me know they had these cute bird houses at Dollar Tree and along with other things for the garden so they have this bird feeder I love the colors here and they have a lot of gardening tools. This is a cultivator, a trowel, a transplanter, and like different cutting tools, like pruning tools, like a needle point pruner, and just different scissors. And I've never seen this at Dollar Tree, so these are great to get in a nozzle for your hose. Dollar Tree also had these brightly colored kneeling pads for gardening, but I think these are useful for a lot of things like for sitting on a hard surface or for cleaning. Like when you get old like me and like you're in your 40s, you just need to like something soft on the floor when you're cleaning. Dollar Tree also had a variety of planters in different colors, designs, and sizes for your needs. And who's ready for Valentine's Day? Moms? Dads, are you guys ready? Because Dollar Tree is here to remind you that it is coming up and you can come here to get all of your Valentine's Day treats and decorations and little baggies, stuff for the classroom for your kids and different crafts here. And don't forget the Valentine's Day socks because that's important, right? And who's ready for St. Patty's Day? Because Dollar Tree is here to remind you that it's coming up March 17th, like two months away. But you can still start preparing. They have the little mini pot for the pot of gold, decorative mesh, wire edge ribbon, and this, these little cute hats, like tinsel hats, and shamrock themed decorations. And necklaces. Here we had some larger shamrock themed decorations that are glittery and shiny. And I'm not really sure what this large one is. If it's a floor mat or something else, maybe it's a bigger decoration. But they also have St. Patty's Day themed gnomes and socks as well. Don't forget the <laughs> St. Patty's Day socks. And here's more fairy village in case you didn't get enough. But this one has mushroom themed houses and the sweet treats houses. Check that out. And here are more Valentine's Day accessories, decorations, supplies. They're just half the store was like full of Valentine's Day things. And look at the little plushies and heart shaped candy holders and gifts for like passing out in the classroom and gnomes and Dollar Tree also had these larger baskets and I don't really know what that is if that's for s'mores like you put a candle in there I have no idea someone please tell me in the comment below and there are these stiff boxes for like card holders and they had lots of signs Valentine's Day signs about love Happy Valentine's Day, loads of love, and 
tabletop signs, the camper theme again, and the gnome, and a white bear. So lots and lots of de decor for hanging and decals for the window, window clings. And there's more wall hangings, hugs and kisses. And I didn't really get this kissing booth thing. I don't know if it's for a movie, but I don't think it's appropriate for a classroom or at an office, maybe at home with your husband or boyfriend. I don't know. So I was confused. And then they had these chocolate, lots of chocolates in a heart shaped boxes and Valentine's Day cards as well. What's interesting is that the card stand from Hallmark says that it's a dollar, not a dollar twenty-five. So I don't know. And here is the section that all moms gravitate towards, and it's for the the classroom favors for Valentine's Day for your kids. They had such a variety here, like little boxes and little stampers and boxes for cards again and buckets for holding stuff and yard signs and this cute candy dish or like for putting jewelry a heart-shaped dish and look at the another kissing booth thing <laughs> i don't really understand it and then there are these wine glasses for valentine's day i love this section for your pets for valentine's day they have my kids have paws and dog mom all you need is love and a cat blessed and pet obsessed my valentine has paws that's super cute dollar tree also had these brightly colored garden gloves oh my gosh i should get one of these and they have potting soil like in small packs so you don't have to buy the big one from home depot and lots of planters again. And look, I found more fairy garden stuff and the gnomes. Dollar Tree also had these little baggies, which I definitely bought <laughs> for my kids. So they could pass out treats in the classroom. And they had these little mailboxes. I got these last year for my kids. They loved it. They put their Valentine's Day cards in them. And they didn't want to throw it away, so... <laughs> Think about that when you get this because they're going to keep them forever until they fall apart. But these are super cute and useful as well. I decided to check out the snacks and food section for the first time. They had Cracker Jacks. They had lots of popcorn containers which is great for movie night at home and making your own popcorn at home. I wanted to see if there's healthy snacks at Dollar Tree and I did find some. Here are these sweet and spicy snack mix, as well as sesame sticks. Dollar Tree also had these gimme organic teriyaki seaweed snacks. I was kind of surprised to find these here, but these are great grab and go snacks for your kids. Dollar Tree had lots of pretzels from Snyder's, mini pretzel bags, like mini snack packs you could grab and go and put it in their lunch boxes. My kids love pretzels, so these were perfect. And they have buttersnap pretzels, which they, they sound interesting. And sourdough pretzels. Stubbs, which makes barbecue sauce, has their own snacks. And they have them here at Dollar Tree. I was also surprised to find them too. And they had these sweet and spicy jalapeno chips. Here are more snack options, Stacy's Pita Chips, Harvest Snaps, Green Pea Snacks. All this talk about food and I'm getting hungry now. And if you look in the bin below, they even have dried prunes. There's a lot of interesting snacks here at Dollar Tree. I was really, really surprised to see what they had here because I never looked. But here we go. Here are some more healthy options like veggie chips, dang Thai rice crisps, fruit snacks, more pretzels, and fruit and yogurt snacks, and cheese crisps, and lots and lots of popcorn, different flavors, cheddar, caramel, butter, 
Then I wandered into the kitchen section because why not? I love these drying mats. They are so helpful for drying pots and pans that are large and for putting it under like your Brita filter to catch the drips of water to keep your counter clean. And we buy a lot of these just to have on hand. And they also have these stove top covers that were really cute designs. Life is a beautiful ride. Dollar Tree also has pizza cutters, which is really great. I've never seen this here before. Maybe I just didn't pay attention. Like garlic presses, whisk, slotted spoons, spoon rests, graters, and toothpicks, and large measuring cups, and napkin holders. You can find so many things here. And I love these chip clips. Check out these cute chip clips. I was also surprised to find parchment paper here. Dollar Tree also had these glass microwavable containers, food containers, and baking dishes like pizza pans. Also found this like pancake container, like a pancake mix container. Like you mix it and then you pour it out of the spouts into your pan to cook pancakes. Another interesting find was this pumpkin shaped muffin pan. They call it a harvest muffin pan. Dollar Tree has lots of drinking glasses like this ball glass mug that you see in Instagram and this cafe style coffee mug. Dollar Tree also has these wine glasses with sayings like it's my birthday month and I'd rather have wine on the shelf a play on Elf on a Shelf. And off the market, happy birthday. And my horoscope said this would happen. Also found these plastic tumblers with a cute design with the truck and the farm. As well as this glass jar with a lid and straw. And another tumbler that looks like a Starbucks Frappuccino shape cup. I bought this avocado slicer because that was interesting, but I haven't tried to use it yet. I also buy all my kitchen scissors here because they get lost easily and at $1.25, it's not a big deal if I lose them. So I have multiple kitchen scissors at home. I use it to cut chicken, cut pizza, open packages, it's just so many uses for the kitchen scissors. Dollar Tree also had these beautifully designed prayer cards and I opened it up just to see what it looks like. And this is what it looks like on the inside. This would make a great gift. Speaking of gifts, I checked out this travel chess and checker set and I opened it up just to see what it looks like inside. Check it out. <laughs> it's kind of disappointing. It's supposed to be magnetic. The pieces are magnetic, but it's just a bunch of foam. And I love the designs of these metal pencil boxes. I could totally see my daughter using them for school. So here you are at the office supply section and they have different kinds of push pins, different styles. And check this out. Yes, I know guac is extra, but so am I. These sassy notepads would make great gifts for someone. So funny and cute. And they had lots of different post-it notes and page flags with cute designs. I think they're great to have on hand as last minute gifts for someone or just to have for yourself. These eco-friendly straw pens were also interesting and I was kind of wondering what was eco-friendly about it and there's no explanation on the package so. Office scissors are also great here at Dollar Tree as they usually cost like $4 or more elsewhere at Target or Office Depot. I've been noticing that Dollar Tree has been kind of emulating Target's office supplies. Like they're kind of like chic and modern looking. Like that copper wire bin. You can find something like that at Target. I don't think it's a bad thing but some of them, some of the items here, the card to understand what they're for. And here's what the Dollar Tree Christmas clearance looks like. It's when you can find something that is less than a dollar. It's 50% off, so there's lots of stockings left. 
And then I wanted to show you what ended up in my cart. So I came here for that moisture eliminator, but I left with a shopping cart full of fairy garden houses and stuff for Valentine's Day. Lastly, let's check out all of the candy here, including cotton candy and chocolates. These are all for Valentine's Day. And chocolate owls, color your mouth pops, truffles, chocolate stirring spoons and Haribo gummy bears, charms mini pops, Tootsie Roll Banks and Warheads and ooh, Chocolate Roses. Mike and Ike's Heart Boxes and Chocolate Kisses. And a Kool-Aid Valentine's Day card kit. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos like this. See you next time. Bye!